How do my artists? So what we're doing today is going to be a little bit different than usual. What it's going to be is a first impression, a review, whatever you like to call it, of the new um, mobile game Pokemon Duel, I think it's called. Um, so just now, as you can see, we've got loading screen, whatever you on your finger, uh, little dots appear. Um, so I think we're just waiting for it to connect. Um, this is going to be quite different, unlike the uh, Pokemon Shuffle uh, strategies. This is just going to be sort of a normal uh, let's play kind of thing. I'm just going to have a wee first impression, uh, see if it could actually be playable um, on the channel, and just what it is in general, um, putting the word out, because I had no idea this was being made at all. Uh, here we go. Going for the English. And birthday. Let's see. Well, let's go. Not 19, no, definitely not 1905. Let's say May the 1st, 1993. If that's my real birthday, I guess. Well, well I know, you just won't know. So, terms of use, yep, beautiful, love it, absolutely, definitely, you can take my first child, whatever you want, yep, yep, all this, love it, love it, love it, yep, accept, yep. So, as I said, I have absolutely no idea what this is, and as you can see, I'm still getting the, um, asked if I want push notifications, so this is the very first time I've ever seen this at all. Um, no data to be transferred, so let's just start the game. I have absolutely no idea what this is going to be like in the slightest. Um, this is the very first time even opening it. Uh, so, start game. Start game. Are you going to start? Here we go. Oh. So, my understanding of it is it's a strategy game. I'm not exactly sure how it's going to work, per se. But I'm quite excited. I've liked the other uh, Pokemon Mobile games. Pokemon Go, of course, big hit. Still playing that occasionally as I'm out for the, oh, for the love of God downloading. Um, let me just skip over this part. Wonderful, and so we're back. As I'm sure you saw that, well, you didn't see that, took a hell of a lot of time, had time to make a cup of tea, had a couple of jelly beans, but let's jump right back in, tapping the screen, very first impressions, uh, even after what, that was about 10 minutes of downloading, um, probably you would have seen it in like 5 or 6 seconds by the time I've edited this video. Uh, so, cool, here we're in an airport, it looks like. The day you've been waiting for has arrived. At last, I am proud to announce the commencement of the Pokemon Figure Game World Championships. And this, ladies and gentlemen, is the grand prize. The glorious jewel tower in all its splendour. That is quite splendorous. Today, Carmenite Island welcomes the cream of the PFG crop. Of you elite players, only one shall prevail victorious. The PFG World Championships are now officially underway, so PFG Pokemon figure... game. This concludes our broadcast from Carmenite Island. And now we're on the airplane. <laughs> He's just called Well Dressed Boy. He is quite well dressed. D37, this looks like my seat. Nice to meet you, neighbour. Thanks. You must be here for the Pokemon figure game, yep, it's game world championships too, am I right? I sure am, well, the choices, this is some kind of, uh, what's that? Uh, telltale, that's like some kind of telltale game show. 
Uh, what's what's your name? I'm sure you can't just be well dressed, boy. Sorry if I caught you off guard there. My name's Luca. I'm pleased to meet you. Anyway, hope I didn't start Mate, you're just standing there in a fucking ascot. Can you believe we have the chance to actually win? You, you win a skyscraper in this game. <laughs> okay, I'm sceptical but enjoying it nonetheless. Luca, say, how long have you been playing PFG? Um, okay, so let's just go through the very quick tutorial. Uh, what's PFG? Although I'm sure both of them lead. So we are in the championship, and we have no idea what it is. You know, it stands for Pokemon Figure Game. I thought every player used that abbreviation. Unless you have played before, right? Nope. Oh, hello. No kidding, entering a tournament for something that you've never even... You're brave, I'll give you that. Okay, thanks for the, the condescending tone there, Luca. Don't worry, I'll teach you the ropes quick enough. You're lucky you ran into me, well. You're the wee gem you are. Ah, but looks like we're almost at Karma Island. Once you've pack picked up your gear, come and find me. Thanks. Uh, look, that's Karma over there. Okay, so this is an island made of skyscrapers. And um, possibly dildos. The pink one looked a little bit phallic. Call a spade a spade, looked like a cock. Airport security have got masks on. It's a little bit ridiculous. Welcome to Carmen Carmonte. What was I saying? Carmonite, Carmonte Island. You here for the tournament? I'll just need your name. Uh, let's go classic name of the channel, Mister mm, Mister Kime, Mister Mime. Let's go with that. Nicknames will be displayed publicly. Uh, nickname can... Okay, Mr. My... Mr. Mime. Uh, Mr. M... Time. Mr. Mr. Empty. <laughs> I'll be Mr. Empty. Nickname cannot be used. Why? Is it the space? Mr. Mimes. That's fine. Probably the space you can't use. Can I go through? I have nothing to declare. Can I... Can I Nice and sharpish right there. Alright, we're signed up for the PFG World Champ. Why are you telling me? You're the airport security. Uh, this here's a dual set. So, he's giving me what I need. Uh, so, we've got a Bulbasaur, Charmander, Squirtle, Rattata, Rattake, and Spiro. Lovely. The most powerful Pokemon he could give us. And you'll be needing one of these two. A mask. This is some... Okay, let's... let's. PFG players have worn these things since way back. It's like an old island custom. Every contestant has one, so expect to see a few masked faces around. Let's go quickly. Hairstyle... Let's go <laughs> really animu. Uh, something normal, yeah, that's fine. Uh, purple, the colour of a Mr. Mime, and skin colour as dark as humanly possible. Let's go this one. Cool. Look at, oh, he's looking suave again. Hey, Mr. Mimes, looks like you're entered in. Well, now that's over, we want to have a duel. I'll explain the rules, come on, let's go. Okay, this is where duels take place. There are figures for practicing with, so let's duel. The first spin decides who starts. What? Spinning? Okay. 
a, I assume I've got to press play. Love how many loading screens there are, that's a sign of a fantastic game. Uh, so I'm going first. Nice, nice looking table. I like the table and chairs. Good decor. Uh, what have they got there? They've got a uh, couple vault orbs, Charmander. First move, first moves mine. Uh, conditions for winning are simple. All you have to do is get one of your figures to the goal on the opponents. Okay. Uh, it's all about protecting your own goal while having. So it's kind of like a game of capture the flag. Uh, six points closest to you are on the bench, all the figures in your deck are lined up there, let's take a look at one of your figures. Um, I'm tapping. Tap a figure to see its status and number the spaces it can move. Now time, now time to make a move. Place a figure on an entry point to bring it onto the field. Uh, let's go to the left. It's MP indicates the number of points it can move, movement points, but for the first move, movement point is reduced by one. First, it's your turn, let's move a figure. Uh, well, I want to move the E. Okay, I'll move it to the right then. <laughs> Once you've moved your figure, that's the end of your turn. Now it's my turn. Well, compelling gameplay so far. Big, big fan, big fan. Uh, I'm assuming I'm going to now attack. Your figure can't move on to or past the point occupied by an opponent figure. Not unless you knock them out of the way first, and the only way to do that is to battle. So I thought this game was... I'm, I'm tapping again. I am tapping again. I thought this game... I'm I thought this game was going to be an online kind of game where you went head to head. It could still be, um, but it seems like there's a storyline if you're going to win the, what was it, Crystal Tower or something. Battles are decided by which attack you spin on the wheel, stop the wheel and use an attack. So stop it by tapping it. Tackle. Bitch got shot on! By the way, a blue attack is a dodge and a red attack is a miss. There are also purple and gold attacks which have various effects. You learn them as you go. If you miss literally any hit will beat you. So you want to avoid them if you can. The losing Pokemon is sent to the Pokemon Center. While it's there, it can't be used. Same goes for any figure in the Pokemon Center. Okay, and now I'm moving Bulbasaur to there. Let's go with it. Uh, so they've got a Lapis. Let me teach you a different technique. Thanks. Um, oh, we're going to re-end the bitch. We're going to spit roast it. If you surround the opponent figure on all sides, you automatically beat them without even battling. Bitch got shat on. Uh, now's my chance. If you use a plate here, you'll be able to take control. If I use a plate, I have a bowl. I've got a cup for the tea. Uh, plate. Meadow powder. Why not use meadow powder? Grass type Pokemon deal 20 plus. Plus 20 damage, this effect lasts until one of your Pokemon, your opponent's Pokemon, is knocked out by a grass type Pokemon. Okay. Stop it here. The pitch got shot on again. So their Vault Orbs now. Once three Pokemon is sent to the Pokemon Center. Okay. I think I'm getting it slowly, uh, but any figure rejoining the bench enters weight status first, that means it cannot be used for one, okay. All over there, I think I understand, and I think I won. Hey, you reached a goal, looks like you win this one. 
やーいやーえー、リーグプロモーション in 1200 After the duel, your rating will change based on whether you won or lost as well as your opponent's strength. You won this time, so your rating has gone up by 50. Yeah! <laughs> Next. It's not too shabby so far. I'm. I think I might play a little bit more of this. When you win duels, you can obtain time boosters. You can have up to three in your inventory. With time boosters, you can unlock them after a certain amount of time has passed. Let's unlock this one. You can see possible drops. Okay, so this is kind of like a, an opening. You can see possible drops. It opens in three seconds. This shows how much time. Start the unlock. And be able to open it. Well, I can open it now. I can open it now. The amount of time required to open a lock booster varies depending on its color. Let's open it. I'm assuming I'm not going to get one of the EXs. Didn't get an EX. Oh, that figure looks well. Looks. Oh no, we didn't have a. Did we have a Pikachu in the last one? No, it was Eevee. Um, no, that figure looks fun. Let's put it in your deck. Okay, so I think I might leave this one here. I'm going to get a little bit acquainted with the mechanics. And so this is just kind of our first impressions. Um, very uninformed review. And so far, it's not too shabby. It kind of seems like a, a strategy game. A, almost. You know, if you've played one of the ones where you've got to collect cards, it seems like that, but within the Pokemon setting. I'm a fan, it's a little bit cheesy, um, a little bit naff, but that's kind of endearing at this stage with Pokemon. Um, so maybe maybe next couple of days I'll put up one where I actually know what I'm doing, I'll do maybe a couple battles in the episode, but this is just very hands-on, first look at it. And it doesn't seem too shabby. Um, let me know in the comments down below what your experience has been with it, if you've liked it, if you've not liked it. And if you'd like to see more, well, I'll maybe do another one once I've got it a little bit more understood. But thanks very much for watching, and how do my artists? Eggs! Eggs! E-double-G-S eggs! <laughs> <laughs>